This past Saturday was doe day, and I got out all day long and enjoyed the day, but didn't quite seal the deal. I had an opportunity Saturday evening on a doe that was only seven yards away, but I wanted to get it on camera. By the time I got my camera on and my GoPro and pulled my bow back, the doe was walking fast. She was already through my second shooting lane, and I just wasn't going to take a chance. I did find a solid spot the middle of the day Saturday, though, that I knew I could hunt on an evening, which was leading out into a field but I had west winds that night and the next three or four nights. So here I am after work, the last week of archery season, hustling up to get to this spot to hunt because tonight I've got a southeast wind and I think I got a great chance to go ahead and bag a doe with my bow on public land. Big doe or small doe doesn't make a difference tonight. It's meat in the freezer. Well, I flew up here after work, got in, it's only like a hundred yard walk to get in, I'm set up, got about, I don't know, hour, hour and ten minutes, so hopefully things start moving quick, just started snowing on me here, so pretty confident I'm going to have a doe come past and be able to finish off a doe tonight.
was hectic. I had one buck come through, then a spike come through, and then a doe came from the direction that the bucks had just gone. I think they had pushed her. She came almost within range, and then her fawns came up behind me, so I'm in the middle of both the mama doe and the fawns. And as I'm watching the mama and the camera and trying to get ready for a shot, if she walks out another two or three steps, another buck comes running by, which I never got on camera because she was staring at me, so I couldn't move the camera. Then she decided to go all the way around 360 degrees and got downwind of me and blew and took off. But holy moly, within 15 minutes, I had six deer all within 30, 35 yards, but it's so thick in here. What an awesome evening to be sitting out in the woods. That was one of the most exciting hunts that I've had all season and one of the most miserable tearing down Whew, with having sticks and a hang on stand and like 35 degrees and wet snow. My gloves were soaked before I got everything packed up and even started to get the hang on stand down. By the time I got the hang on stand down, climbed down, got all the sticks down get everything packed up and get back to the truck. Man, it's been like five minutes and I know everybody's had that feeling before where your fingers hurt so bad as they're getting warm because they were so cold. Man, it's been six or seven minutes in the truck and my fingers are just starting to get back to the point where they're not painful anymore. Three buck, doe and two fawns. Almost had the doe in close enough to shoot. Got one more night archery hunting this season. Hopefully sneak out after work one more time this week to see if I can get a public land doe uh, with my bow. Great night though. Awesome night to be out in the woods, other than the hands. Hey, this is Kurt from Whitetails Deer Hunting. Didn't get a doe yet, but I'm gonna get there. We'll see you.